Hello, this is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can reach us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com and you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Today I want to show you a really cool Western Electric 500 rotary desk telephone. This is Susan's equipment from Texas. And she's got a note here with this telephone. This is the initial checkout. And she's talking about how she had this telephone and another princess telephone that we have here in the shop that we're going to be repairing. And she had these when she was a kid in Texas in her parents' home. And uh, so basically she wants to have them in working condition and we're going to repair them for Susan and we're going to go through this one here because it is the initial checkout and we want to kind of show you the telephone now she's talked about how she wants to leave the stickers and anything that uh, came in with these telephones on the cosmetic end of it we also have a number here that we covered up uh, it's personal information probably and we're just going to cover it up even though that number is probably no longer any good so we want to try to take this handset cord and it seems like it might be still in good condition we're going to try to straighten out uh, some of the tangles in it and we're going to try to use that since it was with the telephone when it came in and we want to give you a look at this phone. It's in good condition for its age. We want to show you the cover. So it was originally black and it was a hardwired telephone. Now, one thing that we want to show you, someone has installed a handset cord for the line cord and what we want to do is we want to go ahead and remove that right now we just want to get that out of the way and this handset cord believe it or not even if the uh, little modular port plug here is smaller if you get it in the port properly it will work now we do know that this telephone does not ring at this time so we want to go through the telephone they've been sitting uh, I'm sure uh, at some property uh, in Susan's family for quite a while and we want to go through these telephones and make sure everything is cleaned and adjusted like the hook switch the rotary and anything that has something to do with its working order now I want to show you something pretty unique to this telephone here real quick if you notice and this is very unique basically we have our C slash D 500 here but we have the suede feet in the front and then we have the kind of a, a rubberish type pad that they went to later so what they did in this telephone when they were putting it together is they used the suede up front and then the rubber type that are shaped basically the same you would find the suede ones on a 302 and then the rubber ones on the 500 sets so and there was a 5302 out there also so it's kind of interesting to see that I'll give you a look at the telephone itself So that's very unique to the telephone and I can tell they're original because they're installed with the rivets that they would have used at the factory and it does not look like this telephone ever went back into the factory or they probably would have upgraded this unit to a modular situation and there is no modular cords on it obviously so it's probably safe to say that it never went back in for refurbishing so we also want to remove our rotary here and we want to get a look at that because we want to go through the rotary that needs to be cleaned adjusted and oiled it still has its original dust cover on it And it has a date of 1957 so we're going to go through the entire telephone 
and we're gonna get a start on this it also has the metal finger wheel and the metal circle for the dial center card now we also want to dial this unit and you can tell it's very sluggish and it barely wants to return so we're gonna go ahead and get a start on this telephone we'll take a short break we'll come back and get some more video as we move forward in the repair of this telephone so we'll be right back okay we're back now and we are finished up with a repair of this telephone we're gonna run through a little bit about what went on we went ahead and cleaned, adjusted, and oiled the rotary. We also installed our line cord so that Susan can plug this telephone into any modern jack. We went through the transmitter, the receiver, the network, made sure all the connections were proper at that network, and we also cleaned the hook switch. So we basically kind of went through the whole telephone. And for those that watch my video, you know that this is our amplified pickup. And we use this in troubleshooting, repairing, and checking out our telephones on the final checkout. And that's amplified so that we can hear the receive audio from the handset on our final checkouts. We also went through the bell circuit and repaired the bell issue because the bell in this telephone was not ringing when it came in. So now we're ready for our final checks. And we want to go ahead and ring the unit. And we'll use the analyzer and ring this telephone. We'll let that go a few times since that was one of the issues. I'll let it go one more time. We'll turn our amplifier on. And we'll give you some dial tone. We want to walk through our numbers. If you watch the analyzer, you'll watch the numbers roll by. I'm going to end in a 2. Now I want to transmit into the handset. If you watch that red light on the analyzer, every time you see that red light light up, that's an indication of 100% modulation on transmit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Hello, hello. So we know that this telephone is ringing in on a ring cycle. It's dialing out. It has transmit and receive. We can go ahead and push this button on the switch box. That gives us a line out and totally takes the analyzer out of the situation. And we'll call a time and temp number. So we'll go ahead and give you some dial tone. And we'll make that call. Okay, we can call one other number. We'll call my number and it'll be busy. Go ahead and turn the amplifier off. Hang the unit up. Now we have a Princess telephone that's next in line and we're going to go ahead and repair the princess telephone for Susan also and so that's why we didn't spend a whole lot of time on these videos because we're just really busy at the shop and I have to move on to the princess telephone now 
But this telephone is uh, a really cool Western Electric 500 set, early model uh, rotary desk telephone. And I'm sure Susan's going to get a lot of enjoyment out of this telephone. Uh, it was in her family, and that's pretty cool that she's having these telephones repaired so that she can use them once again. This is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can reach us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com, and you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.